greetings and welcome to this brand new video so guys if you want to try the new siri ui for ios 18 early on you can simply follow this video the method shown in this video is completely free and legit and you can see i am on this iphone 12 and it is on ios 18. first of all before you begin please connect your device to itunes and please create a backup first okay simply hit this computer or you can also back it up to icloud and then hit backup now so that if anything goes wrong you can easily restore the backup all right so once backup is complete you are good to go you can do this on windows and for that you will need kaobanga light for windows and it is completely free and we are at its official github page so please get to it and get the latest release for Kaubanga Lite for Windows. Also, to run Kaubanga Lite for Windows, you will need iTunes. So simply get iTunes from the official Apple's website and get it for Windows. All right, so once you get the zip file for Kaubanga Lite, simply extract it by right-clicking and extract all, and you will get this folder. Simply open it and then run Kaubanga Lite and simply connect your ios device via usb and you can see it is on ios 18 all right so once you're sure that it is detecting your device and everything is okay now we will get a playlist file which we will place in a path to make the new siri ui animation work now in front of you is the official tweet by the developer on how to do it and how to get that playlist file all right and i will attach this reference to it in the pinned comment from here you can simply get the playlist file all right also i will attach it separately in the pinned comment in case the link is not working for you all right so once you get the playlist file you will simply copy it and then windows r and then type percent app data and the percentage all right and then hit ok you will land here now simply open cowbunga light folder then open workspace and then from here simply select the udid of your device if you are confused or if you have multiple devices attached previously what you will do is simply open itunes and from here you will find your serial number and all other information keep left clicking until you see udid all right this is your udid for your device so please note it and then you can see my udid for the device i am working with is this one simply open it then head to skip setup then head to manage preferences domain folder then hit and go to the mobile folder and simply paste the playlist file you just got now head to cow Obaga light again and you can see i am still on the old siri ui animation all right now simply head to setup options and make sure modify and skip setup is selected then go to apply then hit apply changes your device will restart you see restore in progress and you will see this message hit ok now after your device starts back up you will see the screen iphone partially set up please make sure that you only click continue with partial setup all right please do not click erase and start over all right so once you hit that you will simply head to the home screen all right guys once you're back and your device boots back up to the home screen now we will test the new siri ui animation all right so as you can see i now have the new siri ui animation right here on ios 18 and as you can see it right here the new siri animation works just fine on the lock screen and at the home screen without any issues what is the weather like new york all right so that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comments section 
and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.